now I'm going to be using the Hello Flawless Powder by Benefit. I used this in my last video too. I love this stuff. Um, also, I use sometimes the Studio Fix by MAC. Really good. Both really comparable. This has really good coverage. I really like it. I just use my Beauty Blender. Because I feel like this gives like a really just airbrushed look. Same powder, different brush. This is the Real Techniques Multitask Brush. I love Real Technique brushes. I think they're really great for the price. Um, I think I'm going to use my Modern Renaissance again. Um, I'm going to be taking the raw sienna, mixing it with burnt orange too, which is right next to it. Okay, so I just went in with red ochre, and I'm applying that to my lids. Don't worry, we're going to blend that out. And a little into the crease. The Morphe 535. I love this. It literally makes blending a dream. It makes it a dream. It's so easy. Back in, I'm going to take um, Raw Sienna again. Same brush. I'm going to take my pencil brush and dip into Vermeer, which is this sparkly shade right here, and put this in my inner corner. That's finished. I'm going to do eyeliner. Mascara Time Ride or Die Roller Lash Benefit. You guys need this. It's so good. So, so good. It makes your eyelashes so long. Okay, so I just finished the eyes, and now I'm going to move on to my contour, which I'm going to be using the Pro Glow again, but just the contour shade, which is Sculpt. By the way, it smells so good, honestly, like so good. I'm going to, oh, do my nose. Which I'll be taking, I don't even know, this is a no-name brush. Same color. Now I'm going to bronze up using Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula. Guys, the smell of this literally smells like you're in the Bahamas. And now I'm going to be taking my powder brush again. Oh, by the way, this brush is... Real Techniques blush brush, but I use it for bronzer because I just do. I'm going to move on to, let's do blush. Um, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild. This is in Ap Apricot. 
apricot in the middle it's a new formula I love this color like I honestly I love wet n wild I think they're a great company I think that their stuff is like getting better and better each time so and now I'm going to I'm gonna highlight let's highlight I love highlighting I'm taking my Morphe 510, Jeffree Star approved, love this brush for highlighting, and I'm going to take Stunner from the palette. I believe these highlights are different formulas too. Because the one that I just used seems a lot more than, like, this is strobe. Like, do you see that? Compared to what I just used. Which, it even feels, like, a little bit more. Like, that's what I just used, and that's strobe right on top. So you can tell the one that I just used, the texture even feels different. I think that there's some different highlights in here, but overall, I love this palette, and I recommend it so much. But it gets so dirty, so fast. Because it's mad. I love the packaging. Honestly, I like these Morphe and Real Technique sponge a lot. Like, I think that they're just as good and comparable to the Real Beauty Blender, which I've tried. Um, and I love these. I haven't thought about purchasing the Beauty Blender. Moving on to the lips, I'm going to be using Urban Decay Stark Naked Lip Liner and Amsterdam Liquid Lip by NYX. A little bit more highlight on with my Shan XO palette, which is really nice. This has those and lip colors. So I think I'm gonna put a little bit of that on top of this when it dries down a little bit because I want I want a glossy. Be taking this middle shade right here, girl. These are so creamy. This completes the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe for more videos for the holiday spirit. Um, let me know what you guys want to see down below. Bye.